Hello everyone, it has been quite a while since I've made a video with you and today we're going to be doing an unboxing video, uh, much like one of my other channels, but uh, these are a little bit more uh, Butler Works focused. Uh, I actually entered into a drawing with a YouTube channel, 731 Woodworks, I'll link them as well up in the, up in the corner down in the description, you'll find them somewhere. And uh, I ended up winning, uh, believe it or not, that is so crazy, I love being able to just enter in drawings. And I think the best way to win something is to keep entering. Uh, I've won a few things from various different things. And if you keep entering, you'll eventually win. That's just a game of odds and numbers. So uh, this right here is, uh, I don't know if you can tell or see, but this is the Milwaukee Packout System. I am a, um, I don't know if you can see any of my yellow tools around the garage. But I am a yellow tool man, and um, I'm not going to turn down free tools though. So this is where we're going to start with this Milwaukee Packout system. He actually has already used this, did a full review on it. Let's bring you in as a, I'm doing the unboxing here. This is the exciting moment, opening it for the first time right here. So we got some solid things. I'm willing to bet our Milwaukee batteries lock into these. I don't know for sure. It looks a lot like the DeWalt ones, but whiter. Maybe? I don't know. They might just be the Milwaukee Packout System clips. It looks like we got right here. So let's go ahead and pull this guy out. All right, so this is just a top box here. Um, it goes on top of the rest of a Packout System. And inside, oh, check this out. We got the 731 survival kit with a whole bunch of cool things. And they even got the best flavored Tootsie uh, fruit chew. The vanilla one is my favorite. And we even got a million dollar bill. If you want to get one of these for yourself, go ahead and order anything from their store. I personally have ordered their board butter to maintain all of my cutting boards and wood utensils in my kitchen. And uh, I definitely recommend those ones. So if you want to get one of these, make sure you go ahead and check out their website. And then here we have a couple of pieces or dividers. Let's see what it looks like inside of this one. This is a closed one, so this would be good for nuts, bolts, things like that, that might be loose and run around on you. And then we have another kit with dividers that are removable. So if you have larger items, whatnot, you can use those in there. But uh, here we go, and that stacks nicely on top. This side, we got a little build your own system, talks about the whole pack out system. Another divider here, and I believe these two are interchangeable depending on however you want it. But right now we're looking at Oh, look at all of the other packout options here. This is a full selection of all of the Milwaukee packout gear. I should uh, maybe look into a backpack to go along with my M4 driver I use. I'll link to that video as well. This is going to have a lot of links. Hopefully not too many for YouTube. But uh, that is the top box for the Milwaukee packout. That's satisfying. Oh, I love that. The natural spot, good handles, real solid feeling. This is not some like cheap, chintzy, flexible, flimsy plastic. This is solid and it's got these little guys here. I'm not sure if they're functional or if they're just meant to be strong. So let's go ahead and say, oh yeah, check this out. <laughs> I was talking about the uh, latch on the top. That's exactly what this is and it looks like there's something going on back here. Let's. Check this out. Okay, so right here on the front, you have a handle. So if you ever want to just carry it one-handed, like a briefcase, and then to connect it to the other packout systems, I'm sure it'll latch with this guy, just like that. Oh man, this is cool. Now it's time for the big box. I say I'm not a Milwaukee guy, but my favorite pocket knife is a Milwaukee uh, fast, fast back. 
These things are fantastic. It's got a screwdriver on one end that you can like interchange. <laughs> I love this thing. Maybe a link to the video I did on it, but uh, <clears throat> moving on, let's go ahead and open this guy up. It's got a very similar look on top here. It's got a big old handle. That's gonna help us get this bigger. Oh my gosh, this is a behemoth. Out of here. Wow. Holy cow, this guy is big. This is cool. I don't know what I'm gonna do with this yet, but this is really, really cool. So this is a handle that's just on this one box. So we were talking about it earlier. Let's see if I can do it on the first try. You pull up on this lever, whole thing slides forward and off. And now you can take this piece wherever you need and then you have your base box down here. So if maybe like, hey, I use all of my tools, these things all the time, this guy, boom. That's its own thing. It can be the top box and you can make that little one. This one can be the middle box. You're like, hey, I use these a little less often. Boom. And then let's see if I can get this. Hey, there we go. And now it's all one piece. <laughs> this is uh, this is bigger than I thought. Nice. Got some decent wheels. There's a uh, rubberized tread, but they're a solid plastic wheel. <laughs> Why does this make me giggle? I don't know. But maybe it's because I'm just so excited. All right, let's go ahead and pull this guy back off. Or actually, let's open it up and see what comes inside. Okay, this one inside the... Uh, Way. There we go. This one inside the box comes a uh, mini toolkit and then the same little advertisements and that's it. Maybe a little bit of 731 pixie dust. That's nice. You can just plug that in wherever you need it. All right, and our last one here, this is where we have all of the, uh, this is the base, this is the wheels, this is our main big old fat box. Um, this is our handle here, it's adjustable, you just press that, it slides up. We got a hook down here, I'm not sure what that's for, I'm sure there's something there, They're like, oh yeah, you'll use that for this, and then you got a hook on the back here for, I don't know, strapping it down to your truck or something, I don't know. I'm sure they have a use for that as well, we'll have to look into that, but, uh, Let's open it up and see what comes in the box. Another toolbox, <laughs> just like the last ones. It is a big, empty bin ready to be loaded up. That's nice. This is, this is really nice. I, I think I'm, I'm gonna be, the guy committing all of the blasphemy. I'm gonna load this up with all of my yellow tools. <laughs> Next question is, can it open with the, look at that. Check that out. Like even if this is attached, you can still open it, get to the things you need, close it down. Nice. That is satisfying.
Let's go ahead and pull these dividers out. I wish there was like a place to store them. Take a tour of uh, my blasphemy filled Milwaukee pack out. We'll go ahead and start by our top box here. We have our DeWalt sander and a driver here. We've got some sanding pads there. I know I could probably swap all these little toolboxes out. I don't know what I'd do with these after, but I could swap all these little toolboxes out for ones you can get 3D printed on Etsy and Shopify, things like that. Then on level two, we've got it loaded full of uh, our nail gun, a circular saw, and a whole bunch of nail bits, and then the uh, vacuum attachment for my circular saw. And lastly, at the bottom, we have all of my router accessories and my router. go. This is the Milwaukee Packout system. You can see a head-to-head -head comparison of this Milwaukee Packout system versus the Klein system as well as Flex's system and see which one you think would work best for you. But uh, I was lucky enough to be uh, picked in a drawing for this one and uh, I really appreciate that. It feels really cool to win a drawing like that. Most of us don't usually win these uh, gleam drawings, things like that, but it feels really cool when you do get a win. And so I just thought it would be cool to share with you what it was like to actually receive the winnings from one of these guys. I'll have a link to 731 Woodworks channel where you can watch his deep dive and comparison of this Milwaukee Packout, the Klein Tools one, and the one from Flex Tools, and all of the things that they're doing. He does a full deep dive comparison on those ones, and I think that's a really great video. If you're looking for a Packout system, whether it's Milwaukee or maybe somebody else, Go check out his video. I'll link it down in the description of this video or maybe try and get that in the corner. Who knows? Hopefully you enjoyed watching that unboxing and uh, found it a little entertaining. Let me know what uh, I should do with this to make it a little bit better inside. Maybe some more blaspheme products inside or maybe you uh, know of the perfect accessory I need inside of there to pack everything perfectly. Let me know what you think in the comments down below. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video.